Hi Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. Welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. In this reading, we're going to find out what's your upcoming good news. To book a personal reading with me, all information is in the description box below. And today is the 28th of May, 2023. Time here in Bali, Indonesia is 4.42 p.m. Please bear in mind that this is a collective reading for Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. If you were divinely guided to watch this video, this message is meant for you. Even if you're dealing with the same signs, spirits and angels, please show me for Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. What's the upcoming good news? Mm. Wow. And pray my first at the bottom of the deck. Okay, so the first card was the King of Wands. This indicates desire, actions, um, an individual whom could be a fire sign or an individual whom is very passionate about you, who desires you could be an Aries, Sagittarius, or a Leo. Okay, it doesn't matter the sign. Um, there is somebody whom is going to be very passionate about starting a family with you or building a life with you. A very serious energy, someone whom is willing to invest his or her time on this connection okay but this could also be an indication of some of you if you've been investing in real estate um could be bitcoin could be shares whatever it could be some sort of investment you will see and you're going to be very happy to see the return um whatever that you're getting out of the investment okay some of you some good news in regards to home money happiness family you've got two tens here this these two tens have come out recently on another one of your readings. You guys know I read very, very often, like twice a day for your sign. Um, and you know what? This is definitely a confirmation. A confirmation that this good news comes in every angle. Because number 10 is a perfection number, right? It means perfection. So it's like at all angles. This um, good news is going to make you feel really happy. But also it's going to make people around you very happy. Okay. Because there are so many people here. One, two, three, four. There's a family dynamic. Same goes to the Ten of Pentacles. So maybe it's good news in regards to adoption. If you've been adopting good news in regards to um, pregnancy if you want to start a family but it's it's not like those you know how do you say it's not like it's it feels planned if this has been your plan your plans all of your plans are gonna come to fruition like your basically your most important plan and it has something to do with your future okay and there's one person here right whom is gonna because this is a fire energy, but it could go vice versa. But there's someone whom is going to be very passionate about building a life with you, building a family with you, or building a business with you. If this is a business connection, okay? Just remember this connection, this king of wands, although I'm sensing it's leaning towards like at least at least 70% of you. This is leaning towards um, love, but... With pentacles here, it may have something to do with your money, with your career as well, okay? So some good news in regards to money, career, family, ten of cups. It's going to make you feel so fulfilled. Not of pentacles and one first. Not, not going to be single t for too long if you're single and that is what you're looking for. And it is to be with someone whom you're going to spend the rest of your life with or to meet someone or to have somebody finally committing to you. That's going to happen. That's your upcoming good news. I don't know how long this is going to take because the Seven of Pentacles indicates uh, some waiting. 
a little bit of waiting maybe within seven days seven weeks seven months but for each and every one of you it's different um you know timing is different for each and every one of you obviously it is a general reading right we've got the king of cups here in reverse you're gonna make someone feel like they can't help but fall in love with you so the king of cups is a romantic energy same goes to the knight of cups so some of you your upcoming good news will be actually hearing from someone falling in love with you um willing to give his or her heart to you and we've got page of pentacles here in our verse so it's gonna evolve from maybe a friendship or something that is benign or at its infancy and it will just basically evolve into um the feelings are gonna evolve the connection is going to evolve. And you're going to start seeing like, hey, maybe there is a future for the both of us. Ten of cups, ten of pentacles. If this is a romantic situation, but if this has something to do with money, career, this could be an offer that's going to make you really happy because that means for those of you who are jobless or if you're starting a business, whatever your financial situation, your career situation could be, um, I see a very good offer that could help you not just, it's not just any offer because these two tens, again, they're so important, right? They're so significant that this offer is going to make you happy, make your family happy, or that you may be able to take care of your family. Um, good news in regards of money, career definitely and we've got the four pentacles right here yeah this may some of you this may be something that you've been holding on to hoping for some pentacles that you've been investing in um your time your energy into achieving this two tens here happiness and feeling fulfilled with your job with your money um or with your career or making more money getting the return from your investment all around it's definitely good news i'm seeing i'm so glad because <laughs> i'm also an earth sign <laughs> i'm a virgo let's see more so saw 0707 check out your angel number if you want to okay the emperor in reverse i don't know for some of you good news in regards to retirement okay if you are the the more mature earth sign Good news in regards to retirement because the emperor here is in my first like i'm gonna retire i'm gonna spend you know the rest of my life um happy and feeling secure feeling secure financially spending time with my yeah with my loved ones and we've got the nine of swords here in reverse and then we've got the tower in reverse some good news in regards to avoiding any sorts of disaster yeah any sorts of disaster or escaping from something here eight of swords and one first could be escaping from a disaster again it could be a natural disaster or escaping from being stuck some of you you may hear good news in regards of someone close to you being released from jail it could be anything uh, being released from something any sorts of captivity or feeling stuck you're not gonna feel stuck anymore um yeah a lot of details in this reading it may or may not resonate with you from the beginning to the end so please bear that in mind six of wands and reverse queen of swords and reverse eight of pentacles definitely all has a lot to do with your money with your finances i see an increment i see you making more money your upcoming good news some of you making a little bit more or some of you for a lot of you actually making a lot more okay um six of wands and my first queen of swords i don't know i keep hearing retire retiring some of you it's you you can be at any age actually and you can literally retire at a very very young age as well that's what i'm seeing here that for some of you you may have some inheritance ten of pentacles is, is an inheritance card as well um from your family from anybody i remember um somebody actually told me one of my subscribers she said 
one of my predictions came true because she inherited it was a very unexpected random inheritance it was either from her tattoo artist or head hairdresser i can't remember it was tattoo tattoo artist or hairdresser left um left her his or her uh left her a house <laughs> he he or she i don't know whether it's he or she but this person left her a house like gave her a house i don't know what happened to the tattoo artist or the, i think it's a tattoo artist but it was very random right and she just received this inheritance she inherited the house and she was really shocked right so some of you the tower can indicate something that's very shocking you may inherit something it could be a car it could be a house it could be anything right something that is valuable obviously right ten of pentacles here hmm there's someone you could be kind of ignoring and just kind of go with the flow that kind of energy like i have no control over this person i have no control over the situation and this person is gonna like basically feel much more interested in you or interested in taking actions towards you but i see this family dynamic here good news that you may hear coming from your family or in regards to yourself um if it's not you someone very close to you it can indicate marriage as well someone might propose to you you might propose someone or someone very close to you may be proposed or you may hear this person getting married okay got the page of swords right here some of you getting some good news in regards to education okay this is not going to apply to all of you about education um good news in regards to good grades mm -hmm. i feel like for a lot of you earth signs you've been keeping your head down if you have been keeping your head down just working really really hard i definitely see it paying off you've been saving a lot of money too um you've been saving money i see you like reaching your goals or your target for the month or for the year i see a little bit more i want to get more good news for you <laughs> justice and love first some of you, you may watch someone getting the justice karma that's for some of you if you Think that's good news three of pentacles and love first you may see like a third if you this is just for some of you if you were involved in a third party situation you may hear some good news in regards to their separation okay because three of pentacles can indicate a separation justice can indicate um a divorce some good news in regards to a divorce a separation that's not yours of, co of course it's maybe your person or somebody you may not agree with like this person being with this person because maybe somebody was a liar somebody was mean i don't know it could be you yourself with you know being involved in a third party situation where you may hear or someone may have put you in a third party situation before and both of you may be separated you may hear some good news in regards to them separating because this is, you know, justice and it gets karma. So you may see somebody receiving their karma. Uh, that could be some good news for some of you. Because the page of swords here, you may have been kind of keeping tabs or you may have heard it from someone. Or someone may have been keeping tabs and, um, and relays this message to you, okay? Whatever that this justice and what it's like injustices. So... Whoever has done you injustice in the past, you may hear something about them not doing too well or separating or, you know, falling from the grace. Six of wands, human verse, falling from grace. And for some of you, that could be just good news. You may be happy to hear that from uh, about that because finally you can get some sort of closure. Yeah. Some of you, the Emperor in reverse, someone who may have treated you unfairly or taken advantage of you. I see also this this person not going to do so well and this person may talk to you, ask you for help. This is someone you resent. 
this person might offer you love might offer you money commitment a future to start over you know 10 is a completion of that means something that completes and something that ends something new will happen as well so that could be an offer of a new beginning for some of you from someone who may have taken you for granted embarrassed you at one point in time or put you down you still hold some resentments towards this person you might actually unexpectedly hear from this person okay that's just for some of you not all of you i love these ten of pentacles and ten of cups here whatever the case is the good news that you're going to be receiving is going to make you really happy and you're going to feel very secure and you're going to feel very confident uh, very rejuvenated and you're going to feel like hey i need to really hold this thing very tightly very close to me i don't ever want to lose it or lose it again okay Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn is your reading. Hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm open for personal readings. If you like to book me, my information is in the description box below. Feel free to subscribe to my other channel. It's called Chelsea Vlogs. It's my tarot channel. Uh, sorry, it's my travel channel. <laughs> if you'd like to be notified every time when I post your videos and before I go live, don't forget to hit on the bell notification button. Hope to see you back here again sooner than later. Take care. Bye.